Hi all you fellow newbie riders, you are now learning with Udi. Congratulations on your purchase of your new motorcycle, and hopefully it's a Harley Davidson, just like mine, maybe a Street 500 if you're a new rider with no experience, but you bought the motorcycle and now you're sitting on it trying to figure out how the hell do I start this thing. Now, of course, you know, it's common knowledge, but for some people, you just might not know how to start it, which is not a problem. You know, it can be a tricky thing, depending on what kind of bike you have. You know, especially if you have one with a kickstand that has a kill switch in it, or if you have one that you could only start in neutral, and so on and so on and so on. So, you got your keys, right? So you're gonna put your key in the ignition, turn it on, this is your kill switch. Kill switch kills all power to the bike. What I like to do, because I live in a nice little neighborhood there, and I have to fandango my bike out of the carport and into the yard and into the driveway, I like to put it in neutral so I can back up and get it positioned right so when I take off, we're good. So the first thing you want to do is you, you turned your key on, you made sure she's in neutral. You know, that is <laughs> your gear shifter. Very important you know, to know what that is. But to start the bike, and at least with my bike, the Harley-Davidson, if it's in neutral, you don't have to pull the clutch in to start it. So kill switch, make sure it's you know off or on, and then there's your power button. Simple, right? Okay, so that's easy. Kill power. All right, so now if you're not in neutral and you're in gear, let's put her in gear there. You, know, you turn the key on, you make sure your kill switch is off, and you go to start, nothing happens because you're in gear, so you'll have to hold that clutch in. Now, I like to, when I if I've got the clutch in, I like to at least have my hand on the front brake just in case she starts going or just in case I start to drop the clutch. But the same concept, clutch in, I've got my brake, or if you've got enough balance you know, and you're new, put your foot on the back brake there, and it's the same thing. And it's the same exact thing, you know, you got your key turned on, you got your clutch pulled in, you got your foot on the brake, and you started her up. Okay, now that you've mastered starting the bike, practice with that a little bit, get a, you know, used to and acquainted with how to turn it on, how to turn it off. You know, don't leave it on for too long uh, without it running because I know with my bike and most bikes, the headlights stay on when you have the key turned. You know, you don't want to run your battery down, you know, while you're sitting here just messing around with it. But play with that for a little while, and once you're done doing that, go to the next video, and I will show you how to actually start the bike and walk the bike. So, stay tuned.